Zena, Warthog Princess, and welcome to another video. I'm sorry this video looks a little different and you get me standing up to turn it on and off because it's on my cell phone instead of my iPad. I have managed to fill up the iPad storage and I need to clear it off. But until I do that, today I figured we'll just do it on the phone. It's the same, basically. All right. This video is um, a little bit Harry Potter. It's not Vera or Log or anything specific, but if you've been watching my videos, you've seen I've gotten a few pouches from Amazon, and these are the last two they finally arrived. So the first one um, is the Hogwarts Crest, and then it has the houses on it. So this particular side has Ravenclaw and Hufflepuff, and on the other side it has Slytherin and Oh, not Nettlewood, Slytherin and Gryffindor. So it, it's an interesting thing. It's not as good a quality as I thought when I bought it, but thankfully they were all pretty cheap and whatever. So this is a thin single layer like vinyl and it's, it's, you know, it's printed on there so it's not gonna wipe off or scrape off the paint or anything. It is cylindrical, so it has a little piping and some structure to it on the ends. I mean, it's, you could still bend them and stuff, but it kind of holds its structure. And it's just very simple. It, it is Harry Potter and it does say Warner Brothers on it, but I don't think it's like the high end stuff. <laughs> Anyways, I'm happy with it for what I'm gonna use it for. I'm gonna use it to store a bunch of like keychains and, and charms and things that I have from Harry Potter. So, all right, the other one will get a lot more use like in my bags, I think. This one is the letter, again, but in a different form. This one is like a triangular shaped pouch, actually very nice, and it has the letter on the back. It too is a single layer, like that vinyl type, um, or I don't know what you call that, but yeah. It's sturdy, it's plenty sturdy. This one is a little bit more robust than, well, maybe it's the same. It just, it seems a little thicker, just slightly. Um, but it has the, the seal on the back and everything. And like right now you can hear it has all my little charms in it. So let's look at the charms and whatnot as well. I think it's a good size. This is a great size for the big old tote and, or backpack. Or you could use these for pencil pouches. These would be great. Man, if I was in school and had one of these, I'd have been so happy, especially this one. I just really like it. All right, so what do I have? The recent ones first. I, you've probably seen this recently because I got the Hedwig to go with my Vera Bradley Harry Potter stuff. I still haven't changed the clasp to something more robust. It's a plastic top one. But Hedwig is, he's pretty robust. I mean, he's a, he's a big old thick hunk of plastic or rubber or whatever it is. Um, so that's kind of cool. And then the other one I got recently was this one which is the chocolate frog and it's a golden base thing, but it does open. It's like a magnetic closure and then it has a chocolate frog on a little tether there. So it stays in there, you can't get lost, it became open. So that's cool. And the other one I got recently was this one. It's just the golden snitch. I think whoever sold this on Amazon, I think they just made it just made it. I think they made it, um, pieced it together. I think it's very creative. I don't mind for what I paid that it is um, that instead of like a, a trademarked piece or anything, but I just think that's very creative. And then I added the clasp on it so that you kind of have a keychain or bag charm. I have uh, the rest of this. Let me see if all of it is. Yeah, the rest of this is all from Universal Studios and the last couple trips that I've taken out there, I've kind of just acquired different pieces on each visit. So this one is the Hogwarts Crest and it's a pin. Um, I'm not sure, I mean, I had it on my lanyard, but I don't have a lot of pins. Sorry, I'm sweating. Um, I don't have a lot of pins, so I'm not sure what I was thinking when I got that because I also got the keychain in the same and that's the Hogwarts Crest. But it's pretty robust. It's a big, hefty, hunk of hunk of metal. And I got the same type in the Gryffindor crest because, of course, that's my house. And these are, you know, full of Harry Potter, Warner Brothers from the place. And those are definitely, those are some jangle to them. Now, I'm Warthog Princess. I flew warthogs for my whole career, so like 20 years. 
So I'm very partial to warthogs of any form or fashion. And so I found this one. This is the Hog's Head Hogsmeade Harry Potter. It has a little charm on it that, what does it say? It's just Harry Potter. It just has the name, the trademark stuff. But it's a hog's head, like a mounted, like for the wall. But it's, a, again, a hunk of hunk of, hunk of hunk of metal. But it's a hog's head. Had to love it. Then I got a Gryffindor one. Again, it has that little dangle charm on it, but it's just a, the Gryffindor lion. But it's kind of a thick piece, but it's got cut through. So you can, you know, cut through. But, so these are all pretty hefty pieces. And then I got just a Gryffindor Brave Lion Plate keychain there. I got, I love, love, love slushes. I'll eat a slush in a snowstorm. I don't care. I love them. Shaved ice, particularly my favorite. So butterbeer is something I'm quite fond of. And so in memory of our trip, we just, every time we went anywhere near it, we had to go to the far side and get the butterbeer. But, so I have a little mug for my butterbeer. It's, you know, not intended to drink out of, of course, but just a little memory thing. What does it say on it? It says butterbeer. Okay. And then, because I'm Gryffindor, I just got the Gryffindor thing. And it does have a clasp and it has a little lion charm on there. You can barely see that. But this one does unsnap, so you can hook it on to other things as well. Um, so there you go. Have that, And then I have just a little non-related ring that I was holding them all together with. But I'm going to store them in here. So there you go. Perfect use for that. And that's it. So that's it for the Harry Potter update. Um, like I said, the pouches are from Amazon and all the rest. The A few keychains for Amazon. The rest were from Universal Studios in Orlando. So... Hope that helps. Hope you're doing well. Don't forget to washi washi and stay tuned. I'll be right back with a lug unboxing. Take care. Bye for now.